Hello everyone. I am Maya from News in Short by FTM. Green hydrogen from renewables could become the cheapest transformative fuel within a decade. The world already uses 70 million tons of hydrogen each year as a chemical in some manufacturing processes. Today, nearly all that hydrogen is produced from fossil fuels. If we make that hydrogen clean, we eliminate the 1.6 percentage of global emission that it is responsible for now. But that is just the beginning. Hydrogen is pure reactive chemical energy. If we can bring the cost down far enough and make enough of it, we can also start using clean hydrogen to replace fossil fuels in all sort of industrial processes including important ones like making plastic and steel, liquid fuels and even food. Innovators are working on several different technologies, some of which are more mature than others. One option is to use solar, wind or nuclear power to turn water into hydrogen and oxygen. This process known as electrolysis and was invented in 1800 using the first ever battery that had just been invented by Alessandro Volta. More than two centuries later, the same basic principle may be the key to massive clean hydrogen production. There are four different electrolyzer technologies being developed and the price of each one need to go down to make electrolyzed hydrogen cost competitive. Clean hydrogen opens the door to all sort of possibilities beyond the industry. For example, as more and more electricity comes from variable sources, the world will have to get better at balancing energy supply and demand so we don't go dark when the sun isn't shining or the wind isn't blowing. Electricity can be converted into hydrogen through a process called electrolysis then stored for months at a time and finally converted back into electricity when it is needed. So, the potential of clean hydrogen is tantalizing and its necessity is become clearer every day. Take Russia's war in Ukraine, which has made hydrogen not just a climate change issue but also an energy security issue. The EU has already announced its intention to produce and import 20 million tons of green hydrogen by 2030, enough to reduce its dependence on Russian natural gas imports by at least a third. Thank you for watching us. Subscribe and press bell icon for more breaking news. Suggest in comments and share with your friends. Thank you.